Hi, I'm Bruce Holmquist. I'm the general manager of the Canadian Cementol Association. In 2010, the Canadian Cementol Association embarked on a very ambitious genomics research project that focuses on three areas that are of economic importance to the Canadian beef industry. Fertility, meat quality, and relative feed intake. Tied to that is a very large portion of DNA gathering and assessment through SNP technology that will be tied to phenotypic records that will validate the process and in the end ultimately add value to the Canadian beef sector through the Semental breed. This would not be possible without the funding from Agriculture and Agri-Food Canada and the good work being done at Delta Genomics. Taking stock, transforming the Canadian cattle industry for the next century. Our DNA is what makes each one of us unique. It's what determines the color of our eyes, how tall we grow, and whether we're right or left-handed. Similar to us, cattle DNA is made up of about three billion nucleotides. Any two cows share 99% of the exact same nucleotides. The remaining nucleotides are what make each animal unique. We call these differences SNPs, or SNPs. A SNP can identify a genetic disease. 100 SNPs can match calf with its sire. And 1,000 SNPs can do a complete animal trait profile. In the past, parentage testing was done with blood typing and then with DNA microsatellite testing. Now, SNPs are used. It is less expensive, more accurate, and can be used with other trait-specific panels. Let's further illustrate the benefits of SNP-based testing using this photograph. We are able to zoom in closer and clearly see details we couldn't before. SNPs are like a pixel in a photograph. The more SNPs you identify, the better you can determine the genetic merit of an animal. While the benefits are large, so is the price tag. Delta Genomics is working with its partners to offset the upfront costs producers will have to pay to transition all of their genetic testing to this new technology. It's an important step that will help keep the Canadian cattle industry competitive well into the next century. The AIP project that the Canadian Cemetery Association is involved in is another important piece of the puzzle. Through the funding from Agriculture and Agri-Food Canada, we're able to take historical parentage samples that were done under the microsatellite process and convert them to new SNP technology. The advantage to that is that the Canadian Cemetery Association is doing it at a level of density that allows further identification of the three traits that we are doing in our research work, therefore building upon that and adding further value to the Canadian beef industry.